NATO has begun military exercises at Georgia's uh, Vaziani military base, some 20 kilometers east of the capital Tbilisi. The exercises are codenamed Cooperative Lancer, Cooperative Longbow. NATO is scheduled to hold an official opening ceremony next Monday. The month-long exercises will be held in two stages involving over 1,000 soldiers from NATO members, including the United States and its allies. The first stage began on Wednesday and will focus on training and compatibility with uh, NATO procedures in crisis response operations. The second stage will begin, begin on May the 21st and will serve as a field drill for training peacekeepers. Russia has strongly objected to the NATO exercises. Meanwhile, Kazakhstan, Latvia, Estonia, Moldova, Serbia and Armenia have already reportedly pulled out of the war games. Meanwhile, Russia says it wants to develop a normal partnership with NATO based on mutual respect and mutual benefit and work together within the framework of the Russia-NATO Council. On Wednesday, Russia expelled two Canadian diplomats working at NATO's re representative office in Moscow. The move was uh, in apparent protest over the expulsion of two Russian diplomats from NATO headquarters in Brussels in April. NATO suspended the NATO-Russia Council last August following the brief of Russia-Georgia war last year, but NATO agreed to resume formal political contact with Russia in March. Russia thinks the two sides should bring an end to their diplomatic spat. We now have another confirmation that the policy towards the Tbilisi regime eventually hit back at the interests of NATO itself. That's because NATO forces are at the core of the International Security Assistance Force in Afghanistan.